So let's just talk about everybody. Ow! Oh, the Wraith is still there. Let's talk about everybody being a everybody being a big bag of dicks at this game. <laughs> I'm so mad. Looks like that dude's gone. Yep, that dude's gone. So, once again, I'm with a part. Now, granted, again, this is 100% my fault. Like, there's nobody to blame for this but my own damn self. Didn't I fucking. Oh, there it is. Wait, I got hit? How the f what hit me? What even hit me? Yo, I legitimately did not see what I got hit by. Oh, there we go. I got kidnapped. So anyway, I mean that was that just that fight started horribly because I tracked down the monster. Because again, the entire... And this is 100% nobody to blame for this. But my own damn self. Because, um... It's all up to... You know, like... It all comes down to the fact that you need communication. In a game like this, you require proper communication. Especially to teach people that, you know, may not be that great at the game. Um... To do certain things. And one of those things is, you know, a lot of people still haven't learned. Especially those that don't use microphones. They still haven't learned that the okay, main thing you should be doing is, um, uh, what am I trying to say? The main thing you should be doing is flanking. Um, go off in parties of two, stay at least moderately close together so you can at least, oh, that's bullshit. I didn't know that if you marked it, it's still the decoy kept that marking. That's pretty fucking stupid, actually. I think he can actually just stay there and body the power relay and not have to, like, care. Because this Parnell is not doing very much damage. That's gotta be a decoy. There's no way that's the real thing. That's a decoy. Oh, maybe it is the real thing. He just used that move twice in, like, less than five seconds. Trank gun ready. How fast does I have never used the race? So seriously, how fast does the race shit recharge? But yeah, with the general damage output, like, this dude's using Parnell. You want to be up close and personal with Parnell. You're using a shotgun. It's not a sniper rifle. Oi. Yeah, I really do feel like, just because the general aptitude level, let's say, of these people. Yo, has the bucket player even put down a turret? I just realized. I'm fairly certain the fucking bucket player hasn't even put down a turret yet. So anyway, it looks like this dude's jetted in order to go get more shields. Firing on the wraith. Which is fantastic, by the way. This is why I feel like the wraith is unbeatable in general. Because but you just you have to fight like a complete bitch. There's nothing you can do. Oh, wow, I didn't know you came back after a dropship. Still it. So if I get killed again, which the Wraith... I'm, the Wraith can one-shot me. If I get hit with the right attack, the Wraith will one-shot me. Son of a... Get off. 
Good job. He's dead. Like, there's nothing we can do to get to him. He's dead. That's why you don't fight solo. That's why you don't run off solo. See, he's sneaking again. He's try He wants somebody to come over there so we can sneak attack him again. And this is what I'm talking about. This Wraith is fighting like a Wraith should. But it is no fun for anybody on the other side when a Wraith fights like a Wraith should. There's nothing I can do when he knows it. My damage output is not enough. Wait, is Bucket still alive? But what the fuck is Bucket doing? Die and I'm not gonna do a damn thing about it because Bucket doesn't help us. I got a shitty team. I drew a shit team. I'm just gonna do as much damage as I get. May as well just do as much damage as I can. And just move on. Whoever that bucket player is, just that's the main reason why I like support. Like support is not my favorite class to play. Why are you shooting on this motherfucker? From oh my god, yo, I am gone from this so fast. You have no idea how fast I am going to be gone. These dudes aren't even using their fucking rockets. Their jetpacks to like dodge and shit. Like, bro. He's staying right there in the main fucking pocket. <coughs> oh my god. It's so bad. It's so bad. That's so. Oh my god. Like, I cannot possibly like stress how much I am not a master of this game how much I am just like thoroughly average but oh my god these people are so far below thoroughly average that it hurts me I don't know if I got through it but like at the very beginning of this entire thing I should have used Griffin and just tried to figure him out if I had known how incompetent this team was in general I would have used Griffin that's the, the reason why I did not use Griffin is because um, I didn't know how to use them, but nobody else fucking knows how to use their people either, so. <sighs> so, because, like, at the very beginning of this match, what happened? While we get into I'm going to start a new video. I'm trying to fight as the monster so I can show you guys a video of me playing as the monster. Um, but, uh, what happened at the beginning of the video, or not at the beginning of the video, but right before I started the video. I tracked the monster down by my damn self while everybody else was following the fucking tracks. I tracked the monster down, but here's a fucking shocker. Trying to solo the monster, especially a fucking wraith, is not good for your health. So, I tracked down the monster, I domed that bitch, I hit like 17 fucking markers, I was mashing on my R3 button so we were like, hey, come over here please. Everybody was like 200 plus feet away. I got bent over and handled. I got handled. So, I should have known. I should have just quit out, like, right then. Like, uh, uh, 